Hi, I'm Willow Grace. Thank you for joining me today for another video on astrology and the zodiac signs. So I wanted to share a video for those who want to learn uh, more or just to understand the energy of Sagittarius in astrology and its purpose. So if you want to see more, please hit the like and subscribe button. And I would love to hear your thoughts in the comment section below. So let's dive in. Sagittarius. Sagittarius, they are the big thinkers, the big dreamers. They see the overall big picture. They encourage others to ask the hard questions instead of just accepting what's on the surface. They are the travelers of the Zodiac. They're curious and they're full of energy. They possess an open mind and their philosophical views, they, they're motivating them to wander around the world constantly searching for the meaning of life. Sagittarius is an extrovert, always optimistic, full of enthusiasm and ready for change. That is because, um, and because of this, they are fun to be around. Uh, they prefer spontaneity and adventure, and uh, they're on their own quest for some version of education or higher knowledge. They are philosophical free spirits. Now, areas of concern. They can be inconsistent. They can be restless. And these can be issues because of their spontaneity. This can lead them to jump from one interest to another without committing to anything for an extended period of time. The fact that they see the big picture means that sometimes they can be blunt. If they do commit to things and it conflicts with their personal goals, then they tend to lack that follow through. The ruler of Sagittarius is Jupiter, the largest planet in the solar system, and it's the greatest, it's, uh, the greatest beneficent in astrology. Um, the energy is very hopeful, it's optimistic, it's compassionate, it's generous. Their enthusiasm has no boundaries. I refer to Jupiter as the Santa Claus of the Zodiac because it's bestowing gifts of abundance everywhere and on everything that it touches. Jupiter being the planet of expansion also represents learning and seeing the bigger picture. It is the ruler of prosperity and it requires absolute freedom. Their outgoing spirit takes them from one end of the world to the other, all while exploring different cultures, education, and philosophy. The symbol represents the senator holding a bow and arrow that's pointing upward to the heavens. This is indicating the supreme optimism of this sign and the need for them to keep aiming higher to reach their goals. The archer is struggling between dreams and reality, and the arrow of the warrior is ensuing the, uh, the eventual victory. The astrological glyph for Sagittarius reveals important symbolism of Jupiter and Saturn. Jupiter's glyph is, glyph is similar to Saturn's, but it's written exactly in reverse. This makes sense because each planet possesses opposing influences. Saturn is limits and restrictions. Jupiter is expansion and bringing abundance. So in the glyph, the half circle crescent rises above the cross. It represents mind and matter are linked and mind is able to rise above the material world. Jupiter has a role to expand from its core outwards. Sagittarius is the ninth sign of the zodiac and is the final fire sign. It is mutable, meaning they tend to be flexible and they use intellect and passion to create connections between people and ideas that normally would not interact. They're amazing at networking. They're fluid and they're able to just roll with whatever life brings them. This helps them to navigate the unexpected bumps that everyday life can bring. Sagittarius is the ninth sign of the zodiac that can see the overall picture. Gemini is the polar opposite of Sagittarius. They are similar in that they're both mutable signs that they are mentally agile. They are known as intelligence in motion. So look to where you see Sagittarius in your chart. Notice the planets and the aspects that are within this house. This is where you can expect your Sagittarius traits to be found. I hope you've learned something through this. And I would love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. If you want to see things or find out things when they first come out, please hit the like and the subscribe button. I heard you.